Hey guys, um, how you doing? Just hanging out in Detroit here and um, just wanted to say that we're having a great uh, tour and I want to thank everybody that's been coming out to see me. Last night we were sold out here in Detroit at Mark Ridley's Comedy Castle. Tomorrow night, uh, tonight we're going to be sold out. Tomorrow night we're sold out in Flint and then the next night in Flint. I think there's still some tickets in Wyandotte. Uh, then we're going to Cleveland, Columbus. Uh, we're going to be in uh, Hobart. We're going to be... Where are we gonna be? Let me tell you where we're, let me show you my phone here. This is kind of fun. If you go to my Instagram or my TikTok, those are social media platforms. You can uh, look at a little uh, ad like that and it says all the dates. So uh, tonight I'm in uh, Royal Oak, Michigan, Detroit. That's where we are right now. I was just getting my nails done over there. Uh, and then tomorrow we're gonna be in Flint, Michigan, then Wyandotte, Michigan, check that out. I think there's some tickets. Hobart, Indiana. I think we got some tickets in Hobart, Indiana. Uh, Liberty Township, Ohio. Columbus, Ohio. Cleveland, Ohio. Fort Wayne, Indiana. Louisville, Kentucky. Lexington, Kentucky. Um, Philadelphia. Um, Fort Wayne, Cleveland, Columbus. Lexington, Kentucky. Philadelphia, Newtown, Pennsylvania, Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania, and Saratoga Springs, New York. So the tour is really going great. It's exciting. Um, it's just fun being on the road, right, Charlie? Isn't it fun? Charlie's here. We're having a good time. We're traveling all around. Everything's going great. Thanks for waiting. I was just getting my nails done. Um, man, but it's a lot of fun. I don't know if you guys ever go look at my Instagram, but uh, just uh, the other day I met this nice gentleman, uh, uh, the second time of my life. a soldier who came to uh, the show. Yeah. Nice conversation with them. You can go watch on Instagram. Uh, here's a guy. I met he has a cool wheel. Look at this. Some motorcycle gear. I yeah. used to race motorcycles, so I'm used to that kind of stuff. But this is brand new. So well, let's see this. Uh, let's see this world. What, are you on in Instagram or anything? Uh, yeah, I am out there. Give, uh, and, and TikTok? I'm not on TikTok. Was, how do people find you online? So, so there's stuff over there too. I'd like you guys to go um, over to my Instagram and my uh, TikTok and uh, say YouTube sent me here. That'll be kind of fun, because then I'll know you guys watch this video. But anyways, I just had a nice uh, Mediterranean lunch as well. A nice uh, shawarma, I guess it would be called. And uh, this has gone viral too, by the way. I find it interesting. Uh, if you see here on my TikTok, um, this recently, this video here went viral. This is the a recreation of the uh, classic Subway sandwich and, uh, shop prank where I keep ordering and asking for a little more lettuce a little more lettuce and, uh, uh, can I have some uh, a little more lettuce just a little more lettuce and that is uh, and was some, uh, green peppers originally shot in uh, the 90s for the Tom Green show was sort of a I have some uh, mayonnaise was not a very important bit on the Tom Green show uh, and then when YouTube and, came uh, along, some salt and pepper. it just went viral on YouTube, the original version. And um, yeah. some black olives, please. And uh, people all around the world began ordering their submarine sandwiches like this Can at Subway. A little more black olives. A little more lettuce, a little more black olives. Um, and can I have some of that uh, cheese there? And cheese. what's happened is we remade it for TikTok. And, um, uh, maybe a little more lettuce. And it went viral. I mean, it has uh, yeah, I'll do that. Please. now uh, four, some, some 427, 427,000 views on TikTok as of right now. 
It really is unbelievable. It's extra charge. I'll have a little guacamole here. Yeah. So um, it's exciting, but you can go watch that. I'm actually thinking of um, calling the tour that I'm on right now the uh, Tom Green's A Little More Lettuce Tour. Um, um, hashtag uh, Jeffrey Epstein didn't kill himself is possibly I got to get something in for the modern uh, audiences because um, people really you know there's certain algorithms that we want to try to attract um, so we're thinking either the Tom Green a little more lettuce uh, Tartarian Empire tour or the Tom Green a little more lettuce um, General uh, Admiral Larry Bird discovered um, uh, an ancient civilization on the other side of the Antarctic ice wall tour. I'm not sure. The other thing I wanted to talk to you guys about was, um, you know, I'm not sure whether or not I should be doing this right now. Like, I know you guys like the YouTube channel and, and uh, it's fun hanging out at the farm with Fanny and Kia and myself and Charlie. And uh, we're going to, of course, continue doing, this is really what this channel is, in many ways, a farm life, country life channel. But here I am in Detroit, and um, you know, I wanted to bring you along on my stand-up tour, too, because I, have, of course, am a, a comedian at heart, even though I am a farmer now as well. Um, I am now a farmer as well. I am a comedian at heart. So uh, I wanted to bring you along on that side of my life. And we're on the road right now, as I mentioned, we're going to be uh, sold out tonight in Detroit. I mean, I mean, look at this, look at this nice poster here, look, see? That was, that's, that's sold out on a Tuesday night in Detroit. See, I'm doing good. I'm a real sellout. Um, but I don't like to really, you know, I don't, I don't like to have to go on here and, and do all this promotional stuff, but it's kind of part of what touring's all about. I want you guys to also know that I'm, I'm, I'm coming to your town. It's always such a shame when I roll through a city and then I go on to the next city and I get all these comments on social media from people saying, what? I didn't know you were coming to Cleveland. I didn't know you were coming to Louisville, Kentucky. I'm going to be in Louisville, Kentucky, Louisville, um, in, a, in like a week. And without fail, I'll leave that city and I'll get all these comments saying, why didn't you advertise better, right? So this is uh, essentially what I'm doing right now. But hey, let's just go stand. I'll, you stay here for a second, Tony. I'm just going to get out of the truck again and go stand on the sidewalk over here. And um, stand on the sidewalk here in Detroit. We're going to get Charlie. Hey Charlie, how are ya? I get out and see what the sidewalk in Detroit looks like. Come on, come on with me. You're a good girl, huh? You're a good girl. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Let's just uh, stand here on the sidewalk in Detroit for a second and uh, see what that's like. There's not a lot of people around, but again, I want to continue making content for you guys. Um, it's sort of like uh, this decision that I have to make. Do I shoot a video every day? Is that what you want? Or do I wait? and shoot something really, really special. Um, you know, we are on tour, there's a lot going on. Some of you have told me, no, you'd just like to see you know, Charlie and I hanging out on the street in Detroit, just standing there. Um, you know, it doesn't have to be something crazy every time, right? And then others have said, hey, you know, like, uh, why don't you just uh, do less? So, let me know in the comments. Try to be nice, though. I'm sensitive. I'm a sensitive person. 
I mean, I do. I did have a a two-hour-long show last night. An incredible crowd. You end up late, uh, up late. End up staying up late, and um, it's a lot, you know. So we're just kind of getting lunch right now and standing on the street in Detroit. <coughs> Do all sorts of stuff. Um, that's what YouTube's all about, though. Right? It's about experimenting. Like, I gotta say, I've been doing comedy for 30 years now, and I don't think I've ever done that. Right? So there's all sorts of stones to turn over, to flip over, and experiments to be had. Try it again. Look at this, Charlie. Look. Can you stand on one foot? No, you can't. It's the difference between being a dog and a human being. As you can see, the streets uh, in Detroit aren't really filled with uh, People passing by. Um, Charlie, of course, sniffing this bag here, probably filled with human remains. Um, but no, it's actually quite nice, the city. I was uh, surprised, because you hear all the, the rumors about how uh, Detroit's uh, a tough town, you know? The mean streets of Detroit, but I think that's all changed. I'd say there's relatively zero chance. Well, this guy was at the show last night. How are you, ma'am? Come on over here. What up, Tom? You were at the show last night. I was. Come on, say hi. We're making a video for YouTube. Oh, right on. Did you know that? I did not know that. Yeah, how are you? Kenny. Yeah, Kenny, you were at the show last night. Yeah, I'm about to go skate. There's a cool little plaza right back here. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, this is Kenny. How was the show last night? Did you Phenomenal. enjoy it? Phenomenal. Tell everybody. We had a great time. I've only seen two stand-up comedians, you and Norm MacDonald, and two of my favorite comedians. The show is amazing. That's a great uh, combo. Norm MacDonald is also from Ottawa. Yeah. Are you a big fan of Ottawa comedy? I, I guess I am. Turns out you're a big Ottawa comedy lover. I am a big Ottawa comedy lover. Well, Norm was a friend of mine. Rest in peace, Norm. We love you. And uh, we hope you're uh, watching down on us and uh, having a laugh at our expense. You killed the show. It yeah, was th amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I was just telling people that the show was good and they should come, but I'm glad you showed up because it's possible they don't believe me. Go to the show. And I came to the show because you made a video for your Instagram. Oh. And you're talking to the dude in Lansing. Oh, okay. The army guy. So this and does... And I watched the whole show, or the whole clip, and you're like, oh, I'll be in Mark's, uh, Mark Lee's comedy cast. Oh, well, so this actually is worthwhile then. It, it works. It so what? So works. what we're doing is actually worth doing. Absolutely. Because sometimes I'm not sure if I should even be doing this, you know? Like yeah, maybe I should be taking a nap or something. No, you gotta, you gotta, gotta make the video. Gotta make the. Gotta content. rest up for the show, but then you know I wouldn't have met you if I hadn't made the video in Lansing. That's right. Uh, well, I was first of all I wanted to walk about around uh, walk about around Lansing, but also I just uh, I felt the need to talk a little bit about the Tartarian Empire <laughs> because uh, a lot of people don't know about our true hidden history, where the uh, a lot of the architecture that that's in this country and around the world was built by, of course, a, a long-forgotten civilization that was completely wiped out during the mud floods. Mm. And so they've hidden this from us. And um, between that and the whole Epstein thing, you know, I just feel like people need to be paying more attention. Um, not to mention uh, people aren't taking advantage of the free salads that are available at Subway. <laughs> I didn't even know there was a thing. No, all you got to do is just ask for a little more lettuce, a little more tomato, a little more lettuce, a little more tomato. A little more lettuce, a little more olives, <laughs> you get a little the more bread rest. still. Yeah, and you just keep going, you just keep going. And then you get like a nice four pound sub full of extra salad. <laughs> I got a question for you. Yeah, absolutely. Is a hot dog a sandwich or a sub? Is a hot dog a sandwich or a sub? It's a good question. I don't know. I've, I've heard this before. I, um, Is it the bread that makes it a sandwich or a sub? 
or the meat component? I think a sandwich, uh, generally uh, two pieces of bread with some meat or something between the, the two slices of bread. Um, but um, I guess that does some, somehow describe what a hot dog would be. <laughs> yes. So uh, I, I'm gonna have to go with sandwich myself, actually. Okay. I know that's probably controversial and probably not what Every, there's going to be a lot of uh, leave a comment down below with yeah a lot of controversy <laughs> in the comments about this yeah. but uh, I, I'm going to go with sandwich absolutely Love yeah it. well great man we'll go have a good skate yeah absolutely thanks Tom. for coming last night absolutely you and your buddy were uh, a lot of fun I My saw friends, you yeah. I saw you in the audience laughing real hard you killed me dude yeah You're thank hilarious. you man yeah that was good good yeah. to see you do you still skate I do a little bit but I hurt yeah. my foot last year so I'm really? taking a little taking it easy. Well, my buddy is out in the plaza actually working on the, the flippy dippy trick. So oh, he's, he's working on the flippy dippy? Yeah, we're, we're going to make a video and send it to you. Oh, really? Do you know how to do it? He does, yeah. Oh, yeah? He can skate. He rips. My buddy Jordan. He was at the show, too. Here, hold Charlie for a second. Just uh, go over there a little bit. Can I film this? Yeah, but hold on tight to her, though. Okay. Really get your, get, get your hand in the loop there. She's fast. She's stronger than she looks. It's okay, Charlie. Okay, so the way you do the flippy dippy, okay? Okay. I'm in cowboy boots, so I might not actually do this, but I'm gonna show you how to do it, okay? Because I'm in cowboy boots and I don't wanna hurt myself on tour. But what you do is you, you're skating along, right? You're skating along, right? Skating along. You reach down, you grab your board, you flip it, and there. <laughs> but I didn't really do it right, because I'm, but you grab it, spin it around the back of your hand, switch hands, jump onto it, okay? Got it. See what, I, see what I'm saying? You grab it, spin it around the back, grab it, jump, okay? okay. You got it, I got it. There you it. go. We're gonna go practice it. That's, did you see Charlie? Did you see what I just did there? Yeah, that was called skateboarding. Charlie's amazed. <laughs> Charlie's never seen. Get away from the human remains. A lot of human remains on the streets here in Detroit, yeah, huh? Be careful. They clean them up pretty. pretty yeah, in the bag there. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of that. It's a rough town. Human remains in that bag there. That's so you your possible. skateboard you can get away. Quick. I'm not sure if that's true. Don't. Um, <laughs> what's that? That's how you got the skateboard. You can get away. I, think quick. I scared those people. <laughs> they, they, they clearly sped up. Um, but no. What was this man in the cowboy hat talking about human remains? No, I just well, Charlie's sniffing it out, so she's a good cadaver dog, so. Um, she's also got another life as a cadaver dog, so yeah, we're just always looking for extra ways to make a buck, so <laughs> sometimes they're short on cadaver dogs. Uh, <laughs> I bring in Charlie just when they need a little overflow or whatever. You know, you. gotta pay them bills. <laughs> the mule doesn't feed itself, you know? Fanny? Yeah. <laughs> Only turns right. <laughs> Only turns right, absolutely. <laughs> Tom, great seeing you. Thanks, man. Good to see you, too. Thanks for coming last night. Thank you. Kenny. Good, Good to see you. Yeah, yeah, that worked out perfect. Our office is right right over there, so we're right about Tom's Oyster Bar. Oh, you got a skateboard company? Yeah, it's a clothing brand. That's so cool. What's the company called? Scroove. Right here. Scroove, that's cool. Our motto is choose happy, so it's all about doing what makes you happy. Is it right there? Can we go have a look right yeah. now? Yeah, come up there. Yeah? yeah? It's literally half a block. Are you, could you show us where it, where it is right now? Yeah, yeah, we go there. Okay, how far? Half a block? <laughs> yeah, it's literally right above that condado, right next to that condado taco. Okay, yeah, is, I can check it is out. there a, you have parking? Oh, uh, I mean, you guys could park right here. We could walk. I would, I've got to put a. I don't know how yeah, these meters work. They're I'll, so I'll do it for you. They're very confusing. These, these meters. meters. Are terrible, could you pay for? Could you pay for my parking for me? They used to have. A, See, always looking for a deal. They used to have these better meters. I uh, these in their Yeah, I was having a hard time figuring out. Put a, yeah, I gotta, I gotta roll the window up on the car here real quick. No, keep it rolling. Well, let's do a quick cut and then we'll uh, we'll pick it up. They're collectible because wow. they're still screened. Yeah, look Go at ahead. this. Wow. Welcome to Screw HQ. Oh my gosh, this is great. This is the headquarters. Yeah. This is this, this is, is awesome. Where we skate in the winter. This is cool. This is their training facility. This is great. This is the spot. Here. This is your skateboard company here. Yeah, this yeah. is the brand. We'll get you hooked up with some gear too. Oh my sure. god. Yeah, look at that. Free parking. <laughs> free parking yeah, and some free. This. this is a get out of jail free card. Oh, thank you so much. Because <laughs> you're, you're in the States, they'll arrest you for just about anything. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> <Yeah>. you. <laughs> you just showed up. What's your name again? Jordan Zepp. Jordan, what's up? Yeah, you, yeah, we were talking and uh, you've. Uh, you're part of the skate company as well here? Oh, yeah. This is amazing. I'm of council. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah. And, uh, 
I have an office up the street. So. Are you, what were you telling me just now about the board? I mean, that, I'm surprised to hear that. That's want, all right, you want to learn a little thing about skateboard? Yeah, your, your own skateboard, let me tell that's you. That's unbelievable. I just didn't know that. Yeah. Uh, I didn't know that was something that was happening it's in the world. Board, very collectible. Yeah, show Any them a picture of it. Show them. Yeah, here. I didn't Hopefully know that. Hopefully this guy doesn't screw me and he actually sends it. So that's some unbelievable. So this is the photo of him outside the post office. Yeah. I happened to find this thing this morning. That's my skateboard. That's Tom's skateboard. It matches the Tony Hawk 80s original. That's kind of what it's yeah. based off of. Unbelievable. Except Jeremy yeah. Klein did this one. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Jeremy. What's up, Jeremy? Yeah, and Yeah. so these boards go for like 600 bucks. So Tom's like Are a you millionaire. Serious? I didn't know that. <laughs> I paid $630. He wow. charged me for shipping. Because I got a box of them at home. <laughs> yeah. I would have given you one for like 575 That's fine. <laughs> Save you 25 Maybe it's buy one, get one Maybe free. Maybe cancel that. I'll <laughs> cancel that. I'll sell you one for 575 <laughs> Save you 25 bucks. Yeah, well, no one's crazy enough, really, to, to buy two. Yeah, yeah, no, you can, can you cancel well, that one, and then I'll give you a good one for five, I'll give I you a good could. deal for 525? I should have, man. Okay, well, you know, next <laughs> yeah. time, next time. Well, maybe you have a different yeah. graphic. Yeah, yeah, I might, I might have a gold one, actually. All right, perfect. Yeah, I'll give you that one for 525 All right, for sure. All sweet. Save you, save you, save you, seven, save you 75 <laughs> bucks. You get it from Tom's personal collection. Yeah, yeah absolutely. That's, be that's even better. Yeah, never been skated, brand new. I know. Anyways, well, this is amazing. Yeah. This is amazing to see your place. the apparel wall. Yeah. The screw gear, shoes happy. We get you guys hooked up with some some swag. That's incredible. Get cool. Screwed out. I'm glad we ran into you on the street. Dude, absolutely. What's Tom. the name of your uh, of your company? Uh, screw. And skateboarding, snowboarding, clothing. Where can they find you on social media? Follow us at Scroove and Scroveco.com. S K R O O V E C O dot com. That's amazing. Also tag the skateboard lawyer. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, this is the gear. That's our snowboarding jacket. Oh my god. Rod. That's rad. How are you, man? You were at the show last night too. That's right. It's yeah. my brother Tyler. How did you tell, tell them how you enjoyed the show last night? I enjoyed the show last night. I, I was so riveted I couldn't even sleep. Yeah. <laughs> did you have a good time? Great time. Yeah. There we go. So good. And we ran into you on the street today. Yep. Yeah, it was All awesome. of our dream, my dreams came through. Sam. Yeah. 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 This is amazing. Cool. It was an awesome show. We loved it. You did Tiny Sam. Oh, you were there too. I was there. Yeah. Oh, good. We were awesome. All there. We were all there. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thanks yeah. for coming. My seat sucked. I was way in the back. No worries, no but, worries. But we, we heard most of it. Yeah. It was like a 12 cool. second delay from when you spoke to when it got to the back. It's a big room, big club. Yeah. A lot of people there. So. We're trying to get people to come out to the shows. Oh, yeah. We, yeah. Go. Yeah. Why wouldn't you go? Go to the show. Tom's going to be giving away skateboards. They're yeah. worth a ton of money. Yeah, 25. <laughs> He's going to do a flippy thing. That's the only thing he needs to do in the routine, though, is everyone wants a flippy thing. A flippy in the thing. Routine. Break my leg every night. Yeah, yeah, why not? All right, cool. Awesome.